on the night of June 18, 1983, in the city of Shiraz, in the southern part of Iran. In a public square in the city, 10 innocent Baha'i women were hanged in succession for no reason other than their refusal to abandon their faith. Akhtar Sabit was the second youngest one in prison, but when she went to the judge, the judge had said to her, the fact that you are a Baha'i and you don't deny your faith, it is my religious duty to kill you because you are heretics. They call us heretics, and this is the only reason. They, for hours, for days, they would make us to sit down to write the names of Baha'is, not only in the city, in the country, even outside of the country. And one day, one of the friends who got so frustrated and uh, upset and said, what, what is your goal? He said, well, our goal is to eliminate the entire Baha'i community. And then this friend said, you know, why don't you call all the Baha'is and gather them in one place and kill them all together. And the interrogator said, although this is our goal, but if we do that, to kill all of you together, the whole world is going to see it and protest it. But we are going to do one at a time, then the world cannot see it. The story of these women and many, many other women who are seeking justice and equality is truly one story. And it is the story of incredible resilience of human spirit.